Hey guys, so this is going to be my August Q&A and my camera keeps cutting out and I've tried to film this like four times so I'm just going to go on with the questions. Um, are you going to download next year? Yes I am going to be going to download next year and I've heard the rumours of who might be going and stuff and they sound really really good and um, I'm just going to wait for the um, line up to release in like October or whatever but I probably will go either way so it sounds pretty good. Um, are you planning on getting full sleeves on both arms and would you ever get a hand or neck tattoo? Um, yeah I'm planning on getting both my arms sleeved. I'm having this arm just like bits and pieces um, just put together um, and I'm getting this arm like a proper full sleeve so yeah and yes I would get a hand and neck tattoo. Um, I, there's pretty much no part of my body I wouldn't get tattooed, so, yeah. How do you come up with ideas for tattoos? Um, I'm a really arty person, so, so it's not really hard for me to get inspiration for art and stuff, and all the stuff I have, slash, am getting, all, like, means something to me, or it's from something, pretty much, so, um, that's pretty much <laughs> what I get for inspiration. What's your biggest fears? My biggest fear is puppets. <laughs> why am I so amazing? Um, that's my friend Amy by the way, I love you Amy. Um, I don't know why. I don't know why you're so amazing, you just are. What's your favourite song ever? Um, my favourite song ever is, well the most meaningful one to me is Famous Last Words but, and that's what my side piece is dedicated to so um, yeah. Um, what gigs have you got coming up? Um, I'm not sure. Um, Crown the Empire, Fin Troll, um, Lesson Jake, uh, Real Big Fish and Zebrahead, uh, Bowling Pursuit, and Tenacious D. That I can think of off the top of my head. Um, that's probably not all of them, but that's who I can remember. What was the best and worst year of your school life? Um, all of it was awful to me. I hated all of school, to be honest, so, um, yeah. Would you ever come to Australia or New Zealand? Um, yeah, I want to go to both. How was your sixth form experience? Uh, it was just as bad as school. It was fucking awful, that's why I dropped out. What tattoo are you going to get next? Um, I'm getting my side piece finished off um, in a couple of weeks, like a week and a half or something. And after that I will might get some of this space filled in or my fingers or another one on my leg. Um, I have ones planned out, I'm just not sure what I'm going to get first. Are you going to the Bowling for Soup UK farewell tour? Yes I am. Um, that's weird because I was just talking about that earlier but um, yeah. What are your thoughts on piercing guns being used for the lip and nose? I think it's absolutely stupid. I don't know why any person who's apparently supposed to be a licensed piercer would use that or why anyone would do that at all. It's absolutely stupid. Who's your favourite character from The Hobbit? Um, I'd probably say Radagast. He's just fucking awesome, really. If you could either have no piercings and no tattoos, or never dye your hair again, what would you choose? Um, I would choose never dyeing my hair again, because I wouldn't really care that much, because my hair's naturally blonde anyway. Um, and it doesn't mean as much to me as, um, my piercings and tattoos and stuff, so, yeah. Um, does Kane straighten his hair? No, he doesn't. Um, he just has naturally nice hair and I'm really really jealous. He does absolutely nothing to it and it just goes nice so I'm pretty jealous of that. What are some British stereotypes that you can't stand hearing? Um, one of the things that annoys me quite a lot is um, that all British people have bad teeth. I mean like I don't have perfect teeth, I have like one that sticks out um, but that's pretty much it really but um, not all British people have bad teeth and I don't see why living in a certain country would mean you have bad teeth. I'm pretty sure there's just as many people in America or any other country with bad teeth. So I really don't understand where that stereotype comes from, but if someone wants to inform me then, you know, I'd be quite interested in if um, there's an actual reason why that's a stereotype, but um, I don't know. And also um, another one is that like all British people are like really, really posh and we're all like sophisticated and go around and like bowler hats and best friends with the queen and stuff like that but 
um, the majority, obviously some people are posh and stuff, um, but you know, everyone in Britain is not like that. And um, a lot of people are the polar opposite of that. If you watch the Jeremy Kyle show, you'll get a taste of what actual Britain is like. Um, would you ever see yourself being vegetarian? Um, I am vegetarian, so yeah. How do you keep your hair black and looking dark and not letting it fade fast? Um, my hair actually fades from black really, really fast because um, I have naturally light hair. And um, so I have to re-dye it quite a lot, but I don't wash my hair every day. So um, that kind of helps for it to last longer, I guess. And it also keeps your hair healthier at the same time. So um, I just say don't wash it every day. Yeah, so I think that's all the questions. And I tried to film this like five times before having this one. And because my camera kept on like not filming or whatever. So this video has taken literally like an hour to actually do. So but yeah, anyway, that's all the questions. And if I left any out or bits got cut out, I'm sorry. Um, if you want to be involved in the next one, like my Facebook fan page or um, follow me on Tumblr and I post every month asking you guys to ask me questions. So yeah, anyway, I love you guys lots and lots and lots. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. My links will be in the description to my stuff. Um, but yeah, anyway, I love you guys lots and lots and lots. Bye.